my eyes and like I said, just a collection of things that I've tried to put together that help us to and that fit in the model that I'm going to talk to you about over the next two days. Oh, that's good. So they might hit six or eight, now hit the real bat. But in terms of body position, what are you seeing? Adjustment. Adjustment. Huh? What did the small bat allow him to do? Keep low. Lower and get forward over. Yeah. 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 It's all we're searching for, pretty easy. For Ed, and it's about getting a long, smooth swing through the ball, right? So he's really getting him forward because he wants to be in that position. Not for everyone, but it works for him. That's what he likes to do. Um, thanks, someone different. Just keep sharing it around. Can Lincoln. Uh, technique bat first. I go bat for free. The guy who played some test cricket for Australia. Two of the Caribbean play pretty well. Martin Love. You play for Queensland. Stand on your front leg only, like that. No, serious. You can point your toe if you want. Just get comfortable. I want you to hit it with in that position. Done up, done up. <laughs> <laughs> right. yeah, good. So then you might you go to the go to uh push it up. Big back on one leg. Very different sort of position, but I'm not gonna change it right now, I'm just gonna observe and help find out how it gets Right now, back into a normal stance. Okay. Same thing, what did you feel in your leg? And Wait on the front leg. Okay, so it gave that sensation. Some people like that, some people don't. It's just about feeling strong in that front leg position and really being over the ball. Martin Love thought it was a good one and he did it probably a few times a week. Um, while we're on balance and forward position. So, I mean, that's the best we could do. Best we could do is uh, going to have to do. Sometimes you can actually do this without the board, so we'll see how we go. So, we want to elevate someone's position. Up there. 